good morning <coughs> it's still morning for about 15 minutes here so good morning we are on a mission today um i told you that i had to have a complete new engine put in my car um so they're doing that um they said that my insurance pays for a rental car but it only play, pays for 10 days what's i gonna do they've had my car for a month um they said it's supposed to be ready on the 18th so we'll see about that meanwhile the truck the um oh my gosh the dodge truck is it larry i don't remember longhorn that's what it is um gave a code the other day while wendell was driving it and it said um that there was a problem with the deaf system in there so um he looked it up as he does and um said that you have to take it to a dealer there's nothing you can't do it but if you don't get it to a dealer soon you're going to be limited to five miles an hour so we brought that up here today um Okay, so we went by the Dodge dealership. Now we are at the uh, John Deere place. He's got to get a part for the tractor. Then we'll probably eat while we're here in Noonan. Golden Corral seems to be our uh, seems to be our thing. I might go by Michael's. And then we're going to head back to Fayetteville and pick up the rental car. Then, not today, of course, but Wendell's car, this car is Wendell's car. Um, he was on 285. Gullen or coming from work, I don't know, you know, he's a, he's a train engineer, so he's all the time on the road. Well, a guy ran into him in the back guy waited around for an hour for the police to come meanwhile my husband gets pictures of his car and get pictures of his tag because the guy was kind of shady kind of acted like he wanted to run well police got there and that man was able to convince that police officer that he did not hit him how do you do that Okay, so here's my question is, did he, was he just riding down the road and saw somebody was hit, pull over, wait an hour on the cops, and then say, I didn't do it, and leave? Does that make any sense? They just don't make any sense. So, after all of this, we've got to get the damage to the back of his truck fixed. We're having issues with vehicles lately. <laughs> but, I mean, it's okay for us, really, because, um, well, we don't have the truck now. But we will have a rental car for a few days. And then my mom is still with us, so we have uh, her car. So, eh, it's going to be okay. But it's frustrating. So, um, okay. On to fun stuff. Um, I did have a new order come in. Well, I thought it was coming in yesterday because I wanted to show you last night, but it didn't. But I got a message that's coming in today. Um, that's the pictures I put on the group. Uh, for Facebook 
I put everything that's coming in as far as this order. Now I did drop the fall swig. There's not many. Um, actually they didn't offer many this year. Uh, but I got a couple of surprises I think y'all might like, but I don't want to do it on a video. I want to do it on a live. Um, I may do the live tonight, depending on how I feel. Y'all know how I get when I'm, um, out and doing a lot of stuff and busy and whatnot. It, it absolutely wears me out. So, um, I will tell you, I will try. It's some pretty neat stuff. I didn't get a lot of stuff. Um, like I said, they didn't offer a whole lot. Now, there's a lot coming out in the future. Like, they've released to us. We can see the new patterns and prints and accessories and stuff coming out. Um, but some of them aren't until October, summer, January, summer, you know. So, it's got the release date. So, I might go ahead and pre-order some. But I'm, I'm so tired. I don't know why I'm so sleepy. Oh, excuse me. Um, we are still wanting to continue our um, food. What did I call it last time? Adventure? Maybe? <laughs> I don't remember. Um in the Sonoy, in our local town. Um, so far, we've only done um, the Bistro, which was amazing, and McGuire's, which was amazing. So, next I think we'll do the Italian place, I don't know. But, um, today we'll probably end up going to uh, Golden Corral just because it's you know it, it's not that far away and there's kind of something for everybody but okay the other thing I've been wanting to do um is y'all I have gained I'm just completely honest on my channel so I don't care I've gained 40 pounds since March and I'm not okay with this I have nothing to wear none of my clothes fit but um, I'm thinking I'm gonna try uh, Weight Watchers again I did it for years not years it was years ago but I think I'm gonna try it again and see how that works here's my honey So, I think I will do Weight Watchers again and see if I get the same results. Yep, we went to Golden Corral. It's kind of our go-to thing when we're in Noonan because there's a little bit of everything. So, um, we're going to eat and then we're going to head to the car rental place and get the rental car. Then, I don't know. Good morning. How are you? Hey, I'm good. How are you? Good, good. Thank you. Um, then, I don't know. I might go to Michael's. I don't know. Um, I want to get home and uh, I want to do an unboxing with that order so you can see. And I've got another thing I want to show you. It's a monogram box. Like a, uh, it's a um, subscription box, and uh, it's monogram stuff. It's called Monogram by Sarah, and um, I got some neat, I got some neat stuff. Sometimes the boxes aren't all that great, and then sometimes they're amazing. 
Um, but at least one thing is guaranteed to be monogrammed. Thank you. Um, oops. I do it all the time. I forget to take my sunglasses off. So there's that. Oh, oh. I got more swig in yesterday. So I'll be doing, I'll be showing those too. But we're gonna go eat and then we'll catch back up with you. Yeah, I wanna try um, Weight Watchers again. Cause I've gained a lot of weight um, with all my medical stuff and not being as active as I used to be. So it worked for me before. So we're gonna see if it'll work again. But we are at the Hertz car rental place. I figured it was gonna be a pain in the butt, but um, at least we'll have it but we only have it for 10 days. So I don't like that too much because um, Ford's had my car for a month. But that's okay. It'll work out. So we're at Hertz, um, just waiting on her to pull the car around. They didn't have any SUVs, so I kind of got stuck with a car. That's okay. Um, I'm just trying to be positive about it. So as of right now, our truck is in the shop. My car is in the shop. So we have Wendell's car and the rental car until everything gets fixed. And I think the truck is gonna take a while. My car is supposed to be ready on the 18th. We'll see. Um, I think that's about all that's going on here. Uh, just kind of, kind of frustrating because we're dealing with all of this stuff and this is Wendell's day off. So this is not exactly what I wanted to be doing on his day off. But, you know, it is what it is. But she's gonna turn the, bring the car around in a few minutes and, oh, I guess that's it. Holy cow, that's tiny. But that's okay. All right, I'll catch back up with you in a second.